Welcome to the Cooking Corner in the Air Comfort Solutions Kitchen. We're happy to welcome back Chef Alfredo Vargas from Thank the you. Hard Rock Hotel and Casino doing a caramel flan yes, just in time for the holiday season. Yeah, I think it's a new uh, way that we can put dessert in the table. They just apple pie, cherry pie, something different. It smells great, so I'm ready to learn all about it. Yes, and then this, this is for any special occasion, but we want to introduce it to these holidays. So it looks pretty festive. It does. It looks fabulous. And whipped cream. So very simple. Um, we, go, we have basically here our caramel sauce being cooking. Um, in the meantime, with that's done, we go to three, three components, basically four. You um, said this is quick and easy. Yeah, let's make it four steps, right? Okay. So blender, why? Because I don't want you to get, you can get a ball and stir it with a whisk, but this is a lot easier. 30 seconds, it's mixed very well, you're done. So okay? you have eggs? So we go to put the eggs, which you follow the recipe, is exactly four eggs with a, with a clear and everything. And then we also have our condensed sweet milk, which is already sweet. It's, you don't need to add any sugar, believe me. It's going to be as rich as can be. So you do that, follow the recipe, it'll be exactly perfectly measurements for it. And you have your condensed milk. So you got sweet and just condensed milk, okay? Now, the, la the other thing, the last thing that we're gonna add is our vanilla. And you mix it all together. And what we're if, good to mix it. What mm -hmm. if people at home want to maybe like add strawberries or different things to it? Can, well, that's the end, but can yeah. they add other things as well? None to the mix. Okay. Uh, this is a very silky smooth dessert. It is like crumble. Okay, so, so this is so, the only recipe you can You can garnish can with any fruit you want, but don't try to mix the fruit. And it's not going to be a good any result. Okay. So the next step is, I like to, can I make noise? A little bit? Okay. Um, 30 seconds, 30 seconds, no more than that, right? The next step is, this is where you make your pies, your apple pies, you put your shells on. So when you got your caramel all ready to go, when you put it in the glass, make sure it's very important for you to kind of lay all around it cover, correct? Then when you do this little trick and all the walls got the caramel on it, it's going to be generate that delicious sauce when you flip it over. So it has to look just like that. And we're running out of time, so sure. walk us through it real quick. What's next? Well, we go to add it and we put an oven at 350 degrees, just like that. Make sure you put in your water bath, right here, 350 degrees for one hour. Correct. And when you come back after the hour, what's next? Well, then we got a nice, beautiful platter. Ready to go. This is the your final, final product. product. Flip it carefully. It's a little tricky. And then you go just do your trick, just like this. Voila, it's and ready voila. to go. And this is your end product. Love that. Basically, you can cut it in eight pieces. Do we got time to garnish it or not? Um, you, you can cut it, yes. Okay, we cut eight pieces with a sharp knife. Just try to go even. You can do 10, 12. You want to go... However many people this, you're serving. This, exactly. This is perfectly for eight. And of course, like you were saying, can okay, I garnish it? Can okay, I put some fruit? Yes, you can do. You do your whipped cream. Whipped cream, and then you add the strawberries and then you on there. Add your strawberries right And then top you're of it. ready to go. And then you're ready Perfect to serve. Perfect to serve it. for the holiday season. Yes, ma'am. Thank you so much, you're Chef. We appreciate it. We'll be right back after this. Stay with us. Awesome.